Hey, Amy. Hey, Taylor. Did you know you could program in BASIC on the Atari 2600? What? I know. <laughs> but first, check out our channel t-shirts. And our logo, which you can see like 18 times. <laughs> if you want that on a t-shirt, that's now available in our merch store. That exists. Which is linked through our banner. It's under about. That too. So uh, feel free. Oh, yeah, no, I didn't know it was that. <laughs> to get a Taylor and Amy Show t-shirt, if that would uh, make you happy. Um, in other news, you know, I had the Odyssey 2, and it came with a cartridge called Computer Intro, mm -hmm. which taught you how to program the machine itself. Yeah. And I thought that it was completely unique. You're programming in either hex or assembly, in that, and to the best of my knowledge, there was never a basic cartridge for the um, Odyssey 2. But the Odyssey 2 had a full keyboard, so it made sense yes. to do that cartridge so that you could use it for programming. Yes. So yeah. the other day, I discovered that the Atari 2600, back in the 70s, mm -hmm. also came out with a programming cartridge, and it's basic. Which is... Crazy. Now, <laughs> how do you believe. program BASIC with this controller and no keyboard? You don't. You get these. Show them these, Amy. These. These mostly intact. Keyboard controllers. Keyboard controllers we did a little bit. Now, there were a like... handful, and I mean maybe one hand, full of games that used mm. the keyboard controller, and each game had mm. overlays that would mm. tell you what the buttons map to. We do not have those for basic programming, yeah. although we do have a picture online of what they looked like, mm. and the manual is online, which is good because we're going to do some of the programs from it. But um, we do have... Uh, actually, let me just show you. Okay. Stand by. Stand by. Oh, just produce this Art of Atari. Right? In the book Art of Atari, there is an entry on this cartridge giving you a full version of <coughs> the box art, which clearly has William Shatner on it. <laughs> or that dude, it looks like it's supposed to, or David Hasselhoff. If they had a baby. Right. Which, um, which they should. There are a couple of really good YouTube videos about Atari 2600 Basic, and mm -hmm. I'll link them both in the description, but one of them also includes mapping in case you've lost your overlays for your keyboard controller. So Which this, we have since we never had it. So you choose using the mode button between oh. white mode, red mode, blue mode, and green mode. Yeah. The mode button is conveniently the oh, same man. in all of them. And then you can use the numbers, the letters, whatever you need to do. Oh, and this is great because you you actually put the colors on this. This was a color printed out. I don't have I don't have a color printer. <laughs> You, yes, but you I do, do have markers. But you do have markers, so you I do. Have markers. All right, so I'm going to <coughs> excuse me. Pop the, ah, what's happening? A button is matching. It's this one. Okay, good job, good job. Okay, okay, okay. Oh. It's doing it again. It's still matching. Never mind. I can't get it to stop. It's not that button. Never mind. It's that. The screen is divided into five sections, technically six, but Make one of them's off the screen. The top is the status section, which tells you how many symbols. That is bytes that you have. We have 63 bytes to work with, not even 64, because the line number counts as one, <laughs> and it automatically puts the line numbers in. Oh, the man. speed is nice that you can, you can speed up and slow down things, and you can step through them. Um, the next screen area mm -hmm. is the program that's here. You're going to be typing the program. Then that you get one. the stack and you get the variables. We're not going to use those, but it's very interesting to step through a program. And if you keep your eye on the stack and the variables, you see how the computer is does everything one step at a time. And that's, that's great. 
Um, then this is your output section for any um, text output that you have. And then this is your graphic section. And it's got, there are actually two little boxes that you can move. One is red and one is white, and the red one's on top of the white one right now. But okay. you've got two boxes you can play with. So the first thing we have to do is Hello World. Yeah. Can we? Uh-huh. We can try. All right. So I need to go to, so I need to go to green <clears throat> mode. And so I'm in white mode because my cursor is white. Okay. Red mode, blue mode, green mode. And then I press the button that corresponds to print. And it's there. Now I'm going to need the button that corresponds to a, a uh, quote marker, and that's going to be green mode, uh, that button. I mean, bless the person that came up with this and had to figure out how to do this, but this is, now again, this is nuts. <laughs> each letter is going to take up uh, a byte, so mm -hmm. I don't think we're going to be able to spell out the whole name of the show. I'm just going to do... Not what I meant. I'm just going to do Q. Let's not start with Q. Okay, go to green and erase. Okay, good. Okay. Go to blue and T. A. Y is in green. Mm. Y. Back to blue. L O R. Space. Amy. A. M, Y is in. Why do we both have Y's in our name? <laughs> y. Back to blue. Space. Yeah. S. H. O. And then W in the green. In the green. Bring in the green again. W. And now we need our close parenthesis. And then we're going to go back to white for new line. Oh, man. So not only is it incredibly clunky, <laughs> you have no memory to work with. But I, I mean, you get fast with it. Go oh, to, yeah. and then we need the go to red and the number one. One is the button I'm missing. So I'm just going to use that. That's perfect. All right. Um, and now run is. That button in white. <laughs> it did it. Oh, oh, it did it. Okay, it ran out of symbols because it tried to do it more than once. I yeah. think you have to add a clear... If you add a clear statement, then it'll just blink it. Oh, um, do we have enough... That's crazy. Wait, there's a way to... to um, I don't know if it's game select or game reset. I'm either about to lose all of it or... Okay, game select is going to erase the program and reset all values. Too. Game reset erases all values and it does not erase the program. Okay. Ooh, good. Dude. Luckily, we got the information out. It still has print in there. <clears throat> I like printed the whole line. Yeah, I don't get that. It's self-referential. So we did that. So we did it. We're programming well, Express. We did that in basic on, on Atari, Atari 2600. With a like an Atari 400, an Atari 800. Yeah, they had basic cartridges and they this, were computers. They had keyboards. With but this, I didn't know this existed. This okay, is, this is cool. Um, I am now going to. Reset all of that. Um, okay. There are some. I've got the manual up here on the big screen, which yeah. is available on the um, on the archives. Uh, Who's got the PDF? Up? I want to do the the note mm. command. Is is musical notes? What? Yeah. So um, using the note function. It's red. Note equals so that's equals note plus one. <laughs>
<laughs> That's awesome. It worked. Well, I had to think about it for a second. I had hit halt instead of run. Oh, okay. That's why I thought about it. Note greater than six. Go back to. Okay, I've erased. Yeah. We may or may not come back, but I can't believe this exists. Yeah, that's crazy. And, and it, it's such a compact little tiny thing. I think you only you have a very few lines of code that you can even do. Like it's got a maximum number of lines, but it's also got so little RAM that you'd have to. Um, but there are programs in the book that just like step things forward, like add things or something. They don't mm -hmm. even bother printing it to the screen because you're just going to watch the stack and watch the variables and, and watch how, how it do it and that's how you're going to learn. But I got these, so we could, we sky, could do some stuff. Sky's the limit. Sky. Yeah, we got. The sky is the limit. <laughs> All right. Uh, like and subscribe. Yes. Comment. Bye. Bye. Pizza. That.